Back the COVID pandemic in California after just one week of full time in person learning Roseville High School now going back to online learning. ABC 10 Zach Fuentes joins us live outside the school. Zach, why the distance learning after getting people back in? Yeah, well, students had just gotten back here a couple weeks ago. Administrators say right now there's just not enough resources for them to return to in-school learning because nearly 30 staff members here at Roseville High School are under quarantine. Now, according to data from the Roseville Joint Unified High School District, between January 3rd and 10th, 17 students and one staff were tested positive for COVID here at Roseville High School. And that exposure has led to 18 teachers, seven custodial staff, and two paraeducators, also one wellness intern, all under quarantine. That information information given to parents in a letter. Now, one student we spoke with says the first week back to campus was, quote, chaos because whole classes were being sent home and administrators were trying to fill teacher roles. He, say he, he says he struggled with virtual learning and hopes that this time away from campus will be a reset for him and his classmates so that they can come back to in-person classes. Knows when this virus is going to get in control. And for a lot of these kids, this is like the prime of their education and they need to be in that classroom. District administrators say they understood campus closures would be a risk, saying, quote, we believe learning is best achieved in person, and as soon as we can safely return students to campus, we will do so. You had thousands of students earlier this month signing a petition pushing for the hybrid model because they say that the online learning academy offered by the Roseville Joint Unified High School District didn't offer them AP or honors classes, which many students wanted to take, so they did come back to in-person classes instead of making the choice to stick with the online classes. Now, the target date for kids to return back here to Roseville High School is January 25th. All right, gives them a little bit of time. Hopefully uh, they'll be able to stay in this time. Thank you, Zach.